Hey, what's going on, guys? Minecraft Tutorials here, and welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can download the Jam Hack Client. Um, so, yeah, so let's get started. So, the first thing you're going to need to do is go to Google. Once you're on Google, you can type in Wizard Hacks. And yes, I will leave uh, everything in the description, and I will also leave this guy's YouTube channel, and I'll leave um, this um, thingy, this. Uh, sorry guys, this website. So yeah, so the first thing you're gonna need to um, you, you see, you will actually see when you type in Wizard Hacks is WizardHacks.com, Minecraft Hacks, and Minecraft Mods. You press that, and then a page like this should come up, and then you you scroll down. You can either click uh, Let's Jam, Download Jam, or scroll down until you find the Jam Hack Client. So we're gonna press that. And then you can either da um, download it there, download it there, or download it here. So I'm just going to click this download. And yes, guys, this has Optifine, so it's pretty cool, which is why I'm making a video on it. So yeah. So now all we're going to need to do is wait five seconds, and then we're going to skip add. And then a page like this should come up. You can either learn more, which is right below it, or you can scroll down to the download um part but when you press the download it's just a shortcut so you don't have to worry about that so now we can click the current build and now we can wait five seconds and then we, now we can press skip add okay a page like this should come up you can either get the premium of jam or you can just download the normal thing you know but we're going to download the normal 5.0 version of jam so we're going to click that but every time for me a random page comes up so you can if that happens to you just exit out of it because it's not the right page and then go back on the real page that you're downloading from and then now we can press skip add and something like this should come up but i'm actually going to cancel it because i've already got it so um once it downloads you can pause the video right now so once it downloads uh uh you can go to save uh, uh save i think and then open folder and then it should be in your downloads folder and then mine is right here as you can see you can drag it to your desktop if you want and then now all you can do is pretty much um uh well to do this part you're gonna press the windows key and q something like this for windows 8 pop up, or should pop up and if it doesn't well then you can also press this this pops up for windows 7 and 8 so don't worry guys so yeah but for windows 7 something oh sorry guys something on the left side of the screen will pop up all over picture right now you will see you i percent you like you right percentage a p p d a t a percentage so yeah as i will show you right now so you press that but i'm not a windows 7 so sorry guys sorry for the users that are on windows 7 so yeah so now we can press uh right percentage a p p d a t a percentage you press enter after you write that and then a folder called the roaming should pop up on your screen like mine is right now and then now you can press dot minecraft and then scroll down until you find the versions folder. Mine is at the bottom of all the folders. You click it. And then you open up your jam client, hack client. I forgot to mention, you have to uh, put your versions like a uh, folder type of thing um, to the left side of the screen. And then now you can pretty much like drag it to the J uh, versions folder. So the hack client is already in. So now all we can do now is go on our Minecraft. And then we can press edit profile and then now we can press use version and then release jam client it is right there for me we can press that and then now we can press save profile and then we can press play so we do that real quick So we wait until our Minecraft loads. And then it should pop up like this. So now we can press single player or multiplayer. I'm going to go on single player. I don't know about you guys. So yeah. So yeah, something like this. Uh, sorry guys. 
so yeah you're in a world it's i think it's a little bit laggy for me because i'm recording but so yeah so now all we can do is press um the uh the pretty much the up arrow because there's an up arrow there's a, a down arrow there's a left arrow and there's a right arrow you press the up arrow and then something like this should pop up and then they have x-ray they have world render combat and player and value settings so if we go to combat we have anti-velocity health tags trigger bot uh so look as you can see guys we just have it um anti-velocity health tags trigger bot aim bot um auto block auto disconnect auto respawn auto sword uh bow aim bot criticals fast bow blink killer aura and fast region for, for combat and for x-ray we have gold or iron or coal or lapis or diamond or redstone or or emerald or this lets you see in a world where all the like underground pretty much it's like x-ray so yeah so now when we go to world we can press world and then we can see that there's extended reach anti-swing auto mine auto tool fast place nuka speed gun zales auto wall build uh world edit nuka so that's for world and now when we go on player we can fly glide anti-fall damage anti-web auto eat auto walk sprint bounce vanilla bypass jetpack flight retard sneak spider sprint ncp plus step timer and water walk so that's for player and then when it comes to render we have anti-weather free cam name tax chest esp hitboxes mob esp night vision paper trail player esp traces and x-ray and for values and settings we have we can change the flight the flight speed and we have the timer speed and we have um packet sneak uh free cam teleport and ghost gui so yeah that's pretty much all for this jam hack client i hope you guys enjoyed and yeah one more thing guys you can literally see what they're all writing so if i write at least like i don't know hello or something like that i don't know how to do it i think it's slash irc or something like that no wait it's dot i dot irc hello or something like that uh it should do it but anyways you can talk to random people even if you're in a single player world a multiplayer world world or any of that stuff you can talk to random players online without having to be on an online server so yeah guys thank you for watching hope you enjoyed and if you did please drop a like button on this um on this video tell me which track line you would like to see next and yeah thank you for watching once again and yeah thank you once again for watching so yeah see you guys